What should I start doing? What should I stop doing? And what should I continue doing? What is it in your life right now, and you all know what it is, that's just not serving you? You have a habit, you have a relationship, you have a thought, you have a job, you have something that's just not working. Stop doing that. I'm gonna implore you to stop it and then figure out a way to start something and then keep continuing to do what's working in your life now and do more of it. Well, you know, it's a process to get in here. No, but you- I'm finally uh, at the big table, like on Thanksgiving with the kids, you're probably at the big it's, table. You know? It's exciting, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. So, you know, it's good to have you in here. You know, I've known you for many years. Yeah, I started in sales, went from sales to management, and landed in a company called Prudential California Realty in 1994. Pretty empowering story of your own. Yeah, that's our whole process of learning to go from entrepreneur to corporate America. Let's go hit them up, okay? <laughs> Great, let's do it. How important you feel you are largely determines your success in life. The more important you feel you are, the bigger goals you set. The more important and valuable you think you are, the more you persist. So you are the center of your world and you are important. In personal development, that's one of my passions. I'm continually growing, learning, building my own personal life and business life. And I like to make sure that we're incorporating that with our own company. I was the CEO for a Warren Buffett Berkshire Hathaway company. We grew rapidly, broke sales records. We were in the news a lot new key business connections and relationships with top leaders were formed. I've known Steve for 10 years. He's a well-seasoned executive leader, CEO of Berkshire Hathaway. He has high levels of success. He understands both how to drive a business and how to manage and lead a business. While I was CEO, I learned key knowledge about focused leadership and implementing impactful sales training, resulting in successful, profitable businesses. We were honored and thrilled just to be noted one of the top five real estate brokers in San Diego. And in that top five, we had the most growth and percentage of growth from the previous year. The market has changed in San Diego and it's changed on a national level. I'm very happy to be able to share the good news about my good friend and colleague, Steve Rogers, wonderful new book, it's full of invaluable advice on business and life experiences that Steve has learned and lived and continues to live firsthand. Hey everybody, it's Mark Thompson. I'm a serial entrepreneur. I've worked alongside Sir Richard Branson at the Virgin Group, Steve Jobs at Apple, even Charles Schwab himself, and more recently with Ben and Evan at Pinterest. I love building businesses, and there's nobody who understands that better than our good friend, Steve Rogers. To take any transformation, any struggle that you've had in your life, and turn it into prosperity. You inspire your team to do its best. The three Ps, a key component of my lead to gold formula, does just that. Educating your team about productivity, actions that are measurable, trackable, and accountable, profit, or abundance of capital, and purpose. Doing well by doing good. He's a best-selling author of From Lead to Gold, the foreword by Brian Tracy. I used to call Steve Rogers a national speaker now we have to call you an international speaker. Thank you. You're traveling all over the world with an awesome message. Thank, Thank you. Thank you for stopping in with us hey, on the Craig, American Thanks Dream. for having me. I appreciate it very much. Tell us about where you've been recently. Yeah, I just got back from Manila in the Philippines where I spoke at a conference in front of 1,300 people. It was amazing. It was for the International Rotary Conference. So there was all kinds of different business leaders there. There was doctors and dentists. There was also senators and congressmen.